I tend to sort of always hide in the corner and observe life happening very quietly in front of my camera. I, of course, sometimes we would do handheld and get closer to the subject, but I, I think most of the time what we did is we hide away and let, let the let your subject be themselves in their space. And of course, that would need a, a huge amount of uh, uh, patience and time. And I guess a good producer to <laughs> find you enough money to sustain the shoot. But uh, yeah, I think patience is definitely what you need. Uh, so you did that with a tripod a lot? Yes, we, we, what I, well, on the technical uh, level, what we did every time is, I first would use a tripod. I would not disturb, it's like a crime scene. You, would, you don't want to dis disturb it. You want to be as low profile as you can. Just hide yourself, hide your uh, crew in the corner and observe them. Uh, I, I use tripod a lot. So uh, we would maybe film for an hour of what they do in their real life and we really keep a low profile. And then when I felt I had uh, enough actions. Maybe if you're lucky, you, you get some good stuff. And then we would do handheld, you know, be more active and maybe a little, uh, sometimes you can provoke, uh, maybe ask a question, provoke a little uh, actions. Uh, but at least you had something very raw, I would say, something very raw and truthful. So uh, then it becomes a decision uh, uh, in the, uh, the post-production period, right? how you want to approach this thing, do you want to be more uh, proactive you, or you want to be more uh, poetic and, and you know, still kind of approach.